Hey, what's up everybody? It's Casey, the Rockstar Flipper. And just a little quick tip. I had a bunch of questions regarding eBay sales, downloading to Microsoft Excel to a spreadsheet. And just gonna show you guys real quickly how you can do that if you wanna get all the sales onto an Excel spreadsheet. Now there's many different reasons why you might want to put your sales into an Excel spreadsheet. Um, some people might wanna do it for a sales tax purpose. Uh, that way every month you can download it and keep track of your sales tax. Um, you really should have your settings set to uh, collect that sales tax. Now I know a lot of you guys are gonna ask, uh, how do you do that? I don't have a video on that just yet, but um, I will work on getting that video up. In the meantime, if you need to YouTube it or Google search it, you certainly can. Uh, but this will help you to do it as well if you need. You can download your sales over to Excel. And once it's in Excel, you'll see, which I'm gonna show you in a minute, it will sort these items by state. You'll have a column with the state. So then you can just sort it by the states that you need to collect sales tax for and make it very, very easy. Okay, so we'll just go to our eBay page. We'll go to paid and shipped, which is very easy. You guys know how to get to that under orders, paid and shipped. And then you can come over here to the period that you want to view now this only goes back 90 days so make sure that whatever it is that you want to check on or you want to download get it within 90 days otherwise you're not going to be able to uh, see it um, it's just the way ebay is otherwise you'll have to go to paypal and download transactions from there it's much more difficult um, so just get what you need every month that's basically how i do it i just do this once a month takes me 10 minutes and i'm done Okay, so I'm just viewing January right now, which is what I've got it set to. You guys can see I did 965 orders on eBay alone in January, which is about 31 per day, give or take. Um, and then you'll come down here and you'll select all. Now I'm not gonna scroll down because it has people's information, but you'll just select all, and then you'll come to other actions, and you'll hit download. And then that's gonna download. Now I've already downloaded it, so I'm gonna show you guys the uh, spreadsheet here. So there it is, there's what will pop up. <clears throat> and if you don't get this, and it comes up with another um, option when you hit download to like sort uh, or you know how to set it up, then I'll have to show you guys, I'll have to do another video on how to set that up. But this is what it should pop up to. Spreadsheet with all of your, um, all of your categories, buyer state, city, zip code, name, the item title, uh, what you sold it for, shipping cost, uh, all that good stuff here. And I've uh, blanked out my buyer's information, of course. But right over here is the buyer state. And you can scroll down, and here's one from Florida. Here's another one from Florida. So I could basically just sort this by state, or I could just go in and highlight all the states that I want, and then come over here and highlight all the prices and be very, very quick to get what I would owe in sales tax. It would give me my total price of sales and shipping, and then I could just times that by whatever my state sales tax number is, and I would be all set. Uh, and so this also works if you need any other kind of information, if you just wanna keep this for records, or whatever it is, it shows you dates, date checked out, it shows you if feedback has been left, how you shipped it. Um, it gives you pretty much every piece of information you can uh, imagine, and it's a pretty quick way to do it. So if you guys wanna know how to download your eBay sales to an Excel spreadsheet, that's how you do it. If you have any problems, leave it down in the comment section below. I'll try to help you best I can, or if anybody else knows how to answer the questions that pop up in the comment section, please feel free to help those that ask. Uh, I really appreciate that. It, it helps the uh, load of my time um, when some of you guys can help each other out. Uh, so if you guys like this video, if it helped you out, please press that like button. Make sure you subscribe for more tips and tricks on eBay, Amazon, and online reselling, and I'll be back again a little later tonight with another video. So see you guys next time.